many of you have asked about this. We're at the Winnebago booth off the main campus, I'll call it, because we're standing in front of the Rome, and this is Courtney. Hi, everyone. And she's going to be good enough to kind of give us the what's up on the Rome. And if you're not familiar with the Rome, what's kind of the short story on the Rome? Yeah, absolutely. So this is our first production standard model. That is a model year 2023 B-Van. It is on a Rome Pro Master, and it's accessible through and through. Which means people in you know, disabilities, wheelchairs in particular, yeah. in this case, can get out an RV, which is pretty awesome. Absolutely. Um, would you be good enough to show us some of the highlights? I would absolutely love to. So the first thing to making a unit accessible is to have a way to get in. So that's why we installed this 750-pound Braun UVL. It does stow really nicely underneath the vehicle, so it's discreet while you're in transit. There are two ways that a customer can operate the lift. One with this corded fob, and then another with a wireless fob. So uh, the user has independent access, which is really important to us when designing. So once the user is in, there are wheelchair tie downs equipped in this unit. There are four. So you have a Q strength that just hooks in and attaches right to the wheelchair and they're safety tested so you can ride in transit. Cool. That is so cool. Yeah. So right up front, continuing on, we have this convenient galley. There is a refrigerator, a microwave, some outlets for an induction cooktop, or really whatever you like. And another pull-out little cookboard space that someone could roll right under and use, and some storage as well. This right here is a hanging pantry, and you can unclip that if you'd like. Hanging pantry. I've never seen that before. So yeah, what, what's the idea behind this? So you don't have a bunch of stuff stored up high. Yeah, exactly. So the, quick grab items type of thing. Yep. Within reach, some extra storage that just kind of takes advantage of some of this space that would be otherwise just left out. So the gym bag reinvented. Yes, exactly. <laughs> exactly. But maybe don't eat out of your gym bag. So yeah, that's we have <laughs> for sure. Oh my God. <laughs> Um, uh, awesome. So up front here, both of these cab seats do swivel, um, which is great just for extra seating, but it's also an accessibility feature because if somebody has a wheelchair, they can transfer and then swivel back and face the front. Um, and you can add hand controls at the dealer level if you need to. So it could be drivable if needed. Okay. And I'm seeing a lot of LEDs down here. So what are these bad boys? Yeah. Um, that is just letting us know that the door is open. So it's just a couple uh, of yeah. visual cues. Visual on, cues. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, the chassis has a few of those. Now I'm noticing there's a pop top. So the there idea here is. is. So this is if you have an extra family that needs some additional sleeping space. There is a ladder that hooks in right here and two adults can fit up there. That is cool. Mm -hmm. So the person like in the wheelchair, for example, would kind of park their chair, go to bed. Yep. Probably over here, right? But yeah. the family can travel with them, which is the whole idea exactly. here. Exactly. So if you have some more passengers, but yeah, the idea would be you could roll right up to here. There is a momentary switch where you can put this bed down. Um, so that way you can transfer right from your wheelchair and into bed and this switch does stop so you can even just recline it if you'd like or move it all the way down. Um, Super cool. Another thing I'll show you here is the bathroom. Yeah. So we do have this magnetic curtain that on the outside is kind of a thicker designed curtain and on the inside is more of that water resistant shower curtain material. It is a wet bath with a swivel toilet so it can go either way. And there is an opportunity to add more grab bars if somebody needs them in alternate locations. I kind of wish I had a grab bar in my no, show. right? Sometimes. It's, it's helpful. It um, is helpful. And this here is a clothes rack. So when you're not showering, if you need to hang some things up, you can do so right there. And this is a cassette toilet? Is it that, is. Okay, It fantastic. is cassette. Mm -hmm. um, nice uh, logo <laughs> for sh shampoos and stuff. That's yep, cool. Absolutely. Everything within reach. We do have all controls and the countertops low enough, um, lower by a couple of inches than what you'd see standard so that somebody in a chair could reach them. That is really cool. So curious about the cabinet. Yeah. How do these things work? I would love to show you. So we have um, strapped cabinets and I'll show you why that's important. Yeah. Um, they do clip into place. So they're not, you know, moving around during transit. But so when you're seated in a chair, you can go ahead and flip this open and then you can pull down the cabinet towards you so that the storage is within reach. That is yeah. really nice. Just really easily slides back up. And then if you can't reach the top of the cabinet because you're seated, the strap oh, yeah. assists with the pull down. And nice. then it's just a lock into place and you can go ahead and button it again. Yeah. That is so great. Mm -hmm. What's um keep going. Sorry. So no that's okay. Um we also have this table that I'd like to show you. So again, there's a strap on the bottom to help with lifting it up, but basically this just comes right up and there's an arm underneath that just pops oh, yeah. down. And then if you need a little extra reach, there is a little flip out oh, yeah. extension piece. That's so cool. And to stow it, you just do the reverse. So you'll go ahead and bring this piece back up 
and just gently put it back down. And again, the strap is there for reach. That is so great. So I'm curious. Yeah, absolutely. What has been the public's response to this so far? Is it, uh, I mean, there's not, it's not gonna be a volume unit, but the life enrichment has gotta be off the chart. So what's the yeah, response been so far? Absolutely. You know, I think that the response has been super well received. I think that this vehicle was developed because of a need that we listened to. So the need being there has just been that much more confirmation for us. Um, and for those that don't need it, I think it's been really great for Winnebago that we are moving in that direction. There's a lot of time and resources that go into making sure this is right, done the right way, that we consulted real users. Um, and I think that it's been well received. What a good idea, consult real users. <laughs> yes. right, Winnebago. Well, it's just, again, it's, it's a delight to ha see a, a, a need being addressed and somebody that's already kind of wheelchair bound or something like that, the sense of freedom this could give them. Yes. Is just again off the chart. So okay. you good got job. It. You got it. Freedom and comfort are our two words. So Freedom and you got comfort. It. You got it. Well, thank you so much, Courtney. Thank you. Appreciate it. Bye. I know it's nothing new, but it's so good to see you. We do this every day, and I'm still so amazed by you. lots in early March starting with La Mesa and will be available at more dealers throughout the fall. And price range? So this will be sold for around 134 without the pop top and 144 with the pop top. Wow so it's pretty easy. Well thank you again for doing what you do. This is really great. Thank you so Thanks much. Thanks for the demo. That was really cool. I want one for my rig. <laughs> Absolutely. Thank you so thank much. You. To, uh, to see this. I think the freedom is going to give somebody that uh, is kind of you know, mobility bound. This gives them a whole new perspective on life. I know that a van for a regular person gives them a sense of freedom that is just off the chart. So to give somebody that again is, is, uh, is mobility challenged the same type of experiences and independence. And yet, this is not the pop top, but you saw the pop top. Uh, gives them, they can take a friend or two uh, to even assist that experience even more. So my hat's off to Winnebago, and uh, just thank you for doing what you do. 
to help people have a really richer, fuller life.